हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज विकास वेलकम बैक फ्रेंड्स इन टुडेज वीडियो वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट स्पोर्ट्स स्टार एसीस 2022 अवार्ड्स सेशन विल बी हाईली इंपॉर्टेंट पे अटेंशन टिल द एंड अपार्ट फ्रॉम दिस टॉपिक वी विल आल्सो बी डिस्कसिंग सम इंपॉर्टेंट करंट अफेयर्स ऑफ द प्रीवियस मंथ सो द सेशन विल बी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड इट विल बी अ गुड रिविजन वीडियो फॉर ऑल ऑफ द स्टूडेंट्स सो फ्रेंड्स लेट्स स्टार्ट विद आर वीडियो दिस सेशन विल बी so friends we have an app by the name careers cloud which you can go and download through the play store in your android phones this app will help you in boosting your preparation once you have downloaded this app you can go and log in with your gmail or google id in this application and once you have logged in then you will be transferred to this page here on this page you will be able to see home all courses my courses and doubt sessions also so in the courses if we talk to you in the courses in our if you purchase course from us we will be providing you with multiple material for your preparation material such as your daily current affairs your weekly current affairs your monthly current affairs in daily we will be providing you with 20 questions quiz an ebook that is in your pdf formats of the questions of that particular day then will be providing you in weekly with the same 50 question quiz that will be a compiled and important 50 questions and also will be providing you a compiled pdf of the weekly current affairs then in the question answer format also it will be a very helpful pdf and similarly for monthly also will be providing you important monthly current affairs on a monthly basis so the same content you will be revising maximum number of times and it will help you in your preparation we'll also provide material related to your banking and awareness also and apart from that we'll be covering all important topics such as your apps and web portal important days books and authors national affairs international affairs sports defense awards obituary important days and what not everything will be covered in this topic wise by me only so apart from that we also provide state wise current affairs that will also help you to prepare for the regional exams coming all right so friends this is the app that you should definitely go and download if you want to step up your preparation apart from that if you want to purchase any course from our application then to help you out will be providing an additional 10% discount if you use vikas 10 code i repeat if you want to avail an extra 10% discount on all the uh, purchase you made through the application you will be provided with 10% discount on the purchase by using this code that is your vikas 10 welcome back friends so let's start here we'll be talking about sports star aces 2022 This is an important segment of awards. Here, multiple awards were presented to people, and you should know the national team award, young athlete of the year, young athlete for the female, male, pair athlete of the female, male. All these things will be discussed here. So let's start. As you see in the picture, Neera Chopra. Neera Chopra has been awarded with the Sportsman of the Year award. Highly important. Who is the Sportsman of the Year award? Presented with the Sportsman of the Year award. first thing of the year it has been presented to whom neeraj chopra if the question is asked sportsman of the year award was presented to neeraj chopra but in what field it was awarded in track and field event all right indian olympic neeraj chopra we saw he won gold medal in tokyo olympic games in the year 22 for the year 2020 which were held in the year 2021 due to lockdown then this neera chopra is related to what he is related to which event javelin throw or you can say the athletics event then he won the tokyo olympic gold medal at the tokyo olympic games during the summer olympics that were held so first award remember sportsman of the year award was presented to neera chopra then second award that was presented to him was the sports star of the year here we are talking about male this award was also presented to neeraj chopra so two awards you need to remember for neeraj chopra first is your sportsman of the year award because he won gold medal at tokyo olympic games of 2020 and second award is your sports star of the year award that is in the male category given to neeraj chopra then similarly as we saw here for the male now we'll see for the female who is has been awarded with the sports star of the year award for female she is your mirabai 
चानू मीराबाई चानू हैज बिन अवॉर्डेड विद द स्पोर्ट स्टार ऑफ द ईयर अवार्ड फॉर फीमेल शी इज रिलेटेड टू वॉट स्पोर्ट शी इज रिलेटेड टू वेट लिफ्टिंग ऑल राइट एंड शी हैज ऑल्सो वन सिल्वर मेडल एट द टोक्यो ओलंपिक गेम्स ऑफ ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी इन वॉट इवेंट इन द वेट लिफ्टिंग इवेंट ऑल राइट अपार्ट फ्रॉम दिस रिमेंबर वी सॉ स्पोर्ट्स मैन ऑफ द ईयर अवार्ड टू नीरज चोपड़ा बट इफ आई आस्क यू स्पोर्ट्स वीमेन ऑफ द ईयर अवार्ड here we are talking about sports women of the year award this award was presented to two women first is meera bai chanu and second will be your lovelina borgen lovelina borgen they both have been awarded with sports women of the year award all right for the year 2022 all right so i repeat once again sports men of the year award given to neera chopra sports women of the year award given to two women first is meera bai chanu she is related to weight lifting and lo- sorry lovelina borgen she is related to boxing all right and coming back then sports star of the year award for male category to neera chopra and sports star year award for female was awarded to meera bai chanu so these are important so and then if we talk about the sports star aces awards in why are these awards given these awards are given to celebrate the spirit of excellence in sports and hopes to inspire the athletes and sports person to continue to serve strive to break new records and reach new pinnacles of glory the associate partner of 2022 awards were byju classes and idfc first bank for this sports star aces awards all right then apart from this we saw these were the person who were awarded these award but apart from this some other important awards that you need to pay attention is national team of the year award it was given to india's men hockey team then young athlete of the year award for female it was given to isha singh she is an amateur shooter then young athlete of the year award in male category it was given to nihal sarin for chess paralympic of the year in male sumit until for paralympic javelin throw only and paralympic para athlete of the year for female this was given to avni lakhera she is related to shooting so these are some awards that you need to pay attention if we revise once again neera chopra was awarded with two awards one was sportsman of the year second was sports star of the year then meera bai chanu who is also awarded with two awards one was sports star of the year award for female and women uh, sports women of the year award was also given to meera bai chanu and second women who was awarded with sports women of the year award was lovelina borgen she is related to boxing and these are other awards that you need to pay attention do take a screenshot of this particular awards then if we talk about jury panel you need to remember this is important legendary indian cricketer sunil gavaskar headed the jury panel of the award so who was heading the jury for these awards he is sunil gavaskar important all right apart from this you can see chess stalwart vishwanath anand former indian football captain bachung bhutia olympian anjali bhagwat arpana popat they were also the part of the jury but the person who headed this jury was sunil gavaskar next there was a book that was recently written that is road to 1000 sports star and the hindu group they together have released this coffee table book that is road to 1000 this book road to 1000 is released by former indian cricketer sunil gavaskar sayed kirmani dilip vengeshwar mohammad azruddin changar kant pandit and nilesh kulkarni so who they were the person who released this particular book but what is this book all about this book uh, is about the 522 pages coffee table book that is a special collection of 1000 pictures to commemorate the indian cricket's journey as it says 1000 so remember they here 1000 signifies the 1000 pictures of the indian cricket's journey all right and the person who released this book it was released by if the groups are us i mean the organizations are us then sports star and 
द हिंदू ग्रुप बट इफ द नेम ऑफ द इंडिविजुअल पर्सन आर आस देन इट विल बी सुनील गावस्कर सैयद करनानी एंड अदर पर्सन All right, so you need to remember this road to one thousand. Also, this is a book that you need to remember. That is a five twenty page coffee table book that is to celebrate or to commemorate the Indian cricket's journey. And this book contains thousand pictures. All right, so this was all about the topic that we'll be discussing. Now let's shift to the important current affairs of the previous month that you can have a revision of about. All right. So the first question that I want to ask you is: Tell me where is the India's largest floating solar project? Name the state where is the India's largest solar floating power project located. Where is this India's largest solar floating power project located? In which state? This is in Tamil Nadu. Next question. Where is the largest India's largest reclining statue of Buddha? Reclining statue of Lord Buddha established. Where is it? It is in which state? It is in Bihar, and to be precise, it is located in Bodh Gaya, and Bodh Gaya is located in. Bihar only. All right, reclining statue of Lord Buddha, and it is the largest in India. Next, if I ask you, tell me. Recently, which state has topped in the Scotch state of governance ranking? In the Scotch state of governance ranking, which state topped here? It was topped by Andhra Pradesh. Andhra Pradesh is the state that has topped in the Scotch state of governance ranking. Then, if I ask you, where is the first virtual smart grid knowledge center? Smart grid knowledge center. Where is it located? Tell me the location. I'll give you ten second for this. Tell me the location. State also as well as the district also. it is located in manesar and manesar is in haryana all right then if i ask you what is the name of the world's first medicinal city india's first medicinal city india's first medical city what is the name of the city first of all tell me the name is indriyani medi city Indriyani Medi City. Now, where is this Indriyani Medi City located? This is located in Maharashtra, and in Maharashtra also, where is it located? In Maharashtra also, it is located in Pune. Hmm. Then next, tell me. Recently, which is the state that is with the maximum number of sales of electric vehicle? It is your. Uttar Pradesh, where is the largest charging power station for electric vehicle being set up? It is in Guru Gram, Haryana. And remember, Guru Gram, Haryana, Guru Gram, Haryana is the headquarter for International Solar Alliance. This International Solar Alliance is an initiative between India and. France. This was set up in two thousand fifteen. All right. Then, if I ask you, tell me, who has been appointed as the president of FATF? What is FATF? Financial Action Task Force. Also remember, this is the organization that releases the grey list. And recently, which country was part of this grey list? You are giving ten session, ten seconds for these two questions. Name the president of FATF and who has released or who has been put it into the grey list of FATF. Tell me. First of all, who is the president of FATF? T. Raja Kumar has been appointed as the new president of FATF. And which is the country that was named into the or was put into FATF's grey list? It is United Arab Emirates. Then, if I ask you, where is the, or in which location, where first 
आई आई टी आउटसाइड इंडिया विल बी बिल्ट वेयर द फर्स्ट आई आई टी आउटसाइड इंडिया विल बी बिल्ट इट विल बी बिल्ट इन यूनाइटेड अरब एमरेट्स नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट पेपरलेस गवर्नमेंट नेम द फर्स्ट पेपरलेस गवर्नमेंट यू विल बी प्रोवाइडेड विद टेन सेकेंड्स टेल मी एंड आई वॉन्ट ऑल द पर्सन हु आर वॉचिंग दिस कमेंट बिलो फर्स्ट पेपरलेस गवर्नमेंट इट इज योर दुबई फर्स्ट पेपरलेस गवर्नमेंट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन न्यू चेयरपर्सन ऑफ आई आर डी ए आई टेल मी हु इज ही आंसर हु इज द न्यू चेयरपर्सन ऑफ आई आर डी ए आई Similarly, tell me who is the new chairperson of Air India also. So, two questions for you: new chairman of IRDAI and who is the new chairman of Air India. So, for IRDAI, the new chairman is Devashish Panda ji. And for Air India, who is the new chairman? Tell me. Very good. He is an Chandra Shekhar. All right. Apart from this, tell me who has been awarded with U.S. International Women of Courage Award twenty twenty two. U.S. International Women of Courage Award for the year twenty twenty two. Tell me the answer. US International Women of Courage Award for the year 2022 Who received this She is Rizwana Hasan very good those who are giving the correct answer very good because your preparation is up to the mark you are paying attention you are taking notes all right then if i ask you परम गंगा वी ऑल नो दिस इज अ सुपर कंप्यूटर टेल मी वॉट इज द यूनिट टू मेजर द स्पीड ऑफ दिस सुपर कंप्यूटर एंड द लोकेशन वेयर दिस सुपर कंप्यूटर विल बी इंस्टॉल्ड स्टिल टेन सेकेंड फ्रेंड्स कमेंट बिलो फास्ट इट इज अ रिविजन वीडियो फॉर यू ऑल सो परम गंगा सुपर कंप्यूटर द यूनिट ऑफ इट इज फ्लॉप्स ऑल राइट एंड वेयर इज द लोकेशन दैट दिस विल बी इंस्टॉल्ड इट विल बी इंस्टॉल्ड एट आई आई टी रोड की वेरी गुड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन रिसेंटली अ यंग साइंटिस्ट प्रोग्राम वॉज स्टार्टेड साइंटिस्ट प्रोग्राम वॉज स्टार्टेड हु स्टार्टेड दिस लेट मी गिव यू द हिंट इट वॉज स्टार्टेड बाई इसरो but what is the name of this program and they selected how many scientists or students from this program tell me the name of this young scientist program that was started by isro is uv ka and how many students were selected a total of 150 students were selected from this particular program then tell me 23rd grand master of india 23rd women grand master of india who is she still 10 second friends vim 23rd women grand master of india she is priyanka nutaki apart from this we know who is the number one chess player magnus carlsen Magnus Carlsen during the Air Things Masters, which he won. Air Things Masters was won by Magnus Carlsen only. Who is the third Indian player to defeat Magnus Carlsen during this Air Things Masters? He is just sixteen years of age. R. Pragnanda. He defeated Magnus Carlsen during the Air Things Masters, and which was won by Magnus Carlsen only, and he became the third Indian to defeat this. Uh, Magnus Carlsen. Next question. Next is. Recently, who has been inducted 
इन टू द वर्ल्ड गोल्फ हॉल ऑफ फेम विच गोल्फर हैज बिन इंडक्टेड इन टू द वर्ल्ड गोल्फ हॉल ऑफ फेम ही विल बी टाइगर वुड्स इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन देन टेल मी फाइट चेस ओलंपियाड फॉर द ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू विल बी होस्टेड बाय होम फाइड चेस ओलंपियाड फॉर द इयर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू विल बी होस्टेड बाय विच कंट्री एंड इन दैट कंट्री वेर इट विल बी होस्टेड चल मी इंडिया विल बी होस्टिंग दिस फाइड चेस ओलंपियाड एंड इन इंडिया where it will be hosted in which state it or in what location it will be hosted in chennai highly important all right remember in was it will be hosted by india and in india too where it will be hosted it will be hosted in chennai chennai is the capital of which state so the state if asked it will be tamil nadu so fight chess olympiad for the year 2022 will be hosted by chennai and if state is asked it will be tamil nadu if country is asked it will be india all right then tell me if i ask you tata sky has rebranded themselves to what has changed their name or has rebranded themselves to what it is tata play then if i ask you tell me torgya festival where was this celebrated torgya festival in which state did this festival was observed it was observed in arunachal pradesh highly important question then what was the mascot for the punjab chief electoral office punjab chief electoral office what was the mascot we have done this question multiple times in our videos you should know the name what is the name of the mascot tell me the name of the mascot is shera very good the name of the mascot of punjab's chief electoral office is shera all right we saw torgya festival it was observed in arunachal pradesh so tell me one more festival that is spitu gaster festival Spituk Guster Festival. Where do we observe this? This is the last question for the video and an important one. So tell me, where is the Spituk Guster Festival observed? Where is it observed? It is observed in Ladakh. All right, important. So these are some important current affairs for the previous month. all right and they are an important ones you should definitely pay attention to them so friends this was our video i hope you enjoyed it do like the video and if you want us to bring such sessions in future if you want the revision videos if you want some other type of content that you want to study all you have to do is comment below because the value of your comment is very much we respect your comment and we definitely value your comment Also if you have any trouble regarding login or payment or any other issues then you can reach to us on our mail that is support at the rate of affairscloud.com or you can call us on the number 9677333862 and we'll resolve your issue as soon as possible also you should go and check our courses that are available at a very reasonable price and that will help you to boost your preparation